Welcome back to the show. Today I'm very excited to have on board with us two special guests, Imran Habib and Irfan Lawrence from the band Naqsh, who's set to release their first album. Imran, Irfan, welcome to the show. Thank you. Thank you for having us today. So you're with the band Naqsh. Tell us a little bit about what, uh, what Naqsh means. Uh, Naqsh actually means impression uh, in Urdu or Hindi. So we just want to make an impression in people's hearts, and you know that's why we named it Nux. Make an impression in people's hearts. Yeah. It's very <laughs> sweet. And uh, tell us a bit about the music that you play. Uh, the music is a combination of um, traditional rock um, and uh, tunes from uh, our home countries like mm -hmm. India and Pakistan. Mm -hmm. As uh, me and Imran, we're from Pakistan, and Daksh is from India. So that whole uh, flavor of that music combined with the rock, that's what we're aiming for, to, so that it's pleasing to the ears and it comes a memory in their hearts. So would you feel that, is it safe to say that the music itself has been infused with those memories that are from your, your home country? Yes, absolutely, it, it, your childhood. And hence I, it comes from the heart? Yes. yes, it does. It does come from the heart and uh, basically, you know, um, uh, it, the band sound itself is uh, is unique in a way because we both are like we we all three of us are from different part of uh, we both are from Pakistan and he's from India so that's why the sound is unique and a lot of people who have heard the music or have talked about the music they have said that you know it's a unique sound it mm -hmm. um, and it's because of the collaboration of India and Pakistan. So you've been together for over a decade. I guess Naksh has been around for over a decade, yes. and um, you know, quite recently you've you've been able to get you know get through your, your actual vibe of music that you want to play, and you're set now to release your new album. What is everybody's role in the band? Um, Daksh is basically Daksh. He's not here today, but I'll talk a little bit about him. He's a, he's a He's an excellent composer. He's the one who composes all the songs. Mm -hmm. uh, then myself and uh, Irfan Bhai, we just help with the arrangement of songs. Um, it took us long to come up with the first album is because uh, we, have, uh, we have come a long way as well as a band as mm -hmm. well. We have matured a lot. Uh, I think the music has changed a lot as well. Uh, and that was that's why we came, came up with uh, with the album, so it took us so long to come up with an album. So, in terms of instruments, you play the bass guitar. Is it I I play uh, lead, and he lead plays, uh, and Daksh does the rhythm guitar and the vocals. Okay, and so where locally? I know that locally you're um, in Vancouver. You've you've your name is quite well known, and uh, you know everybody's really excited, and they're starting to talk about the music, your album being launched. So, tell us where you've performed before. Uh, we've performed at um, different uh, uh, local events, like um, there's an organization uh, that arranges Pakistani events, we've performed with them, uh, we've uh, also worked with uh, um, the Olympics Committee, the 2010 Winter Olympics. The Olympics, you yes. performed at the Olympics, yeah, was, what an honor. It is, it is, and we're humbled by it, and it was such a great experience, we did the three, three different shows, mm -hmm. um, and then we also uh, opened up for um, uh, we did uh, perform with Q Kurikul and Baloch QB from Pakistan. We opened up for um, uh, uh, Sain Zahoor. Um, Sain Zahoor. And didn't you recently do the Adnan Sami concert as yes, well? Yes, we did that. So yeah. what was that experience like? It was great. It was great. There's, uh, the musicians that were with Adnan Sami, they were a, ple a pleasure to watch. And our, our initial set was also uh, liked by people. So I guess we did a good job, hopefully. Of course, that's why you're here, right? <laughs> so, in terms of now, like you're you're about to embark upon this amazing journey, uh, you know, you've you've gotten some press out in, in Pakistan as well. So, tell us, what does it take to be, uh, you know, to be on that world stage? What, what's that journey like? It's runway. Go ahead. No, go ahead. Okay, it, actually. Uh, it's uh, this journey uh, of music started in 2010, and it has come uh, like we have come a long way uh, from there. But you know, all the way, what has uh, kept us in that 
in, in music and together is the passion of our music. Yes. So the, you know, heart and soul of this band is all about uh, music, all about uh, spreading the word of peace and, uh, you know, harmony amongst, amongst uh, both the countries as well. Um, that's what the that's what has kept us together mm -hmm. you know the passion for music and then you know uh, spreading the word uh, uh, word of love and uh, peace such a beautiful message spreading the word of love and peace so i mean now that you are you know you, you're both of you come from pakistan roots um, daksh comes with indian roots mm. so as an immigrant in this country you know even though you're you're both you know, all of you are canadian but Still, as an immigrant, tell us what sort of challenges did you face in order to get here, in order to get here to release your new album? Um, there was a limited number of avenues that we could explore when it came to uh, uh, giving our music out there. Um, that's because uh, the, uh, the kind of music you're playing, uh, a lot of it's not for everybody. Uh, lyrics are for a certain uh, number of people. So uh, it was hard to kind of expand locally. Um, and uh, after a certain level, we thought that we had hit a ceiling. And that's why we wanted to explore uh, Indian and Pakistani markets now. Wow. And now you, you know, you've got your release date coming up soon. How will, um, when is your album available and, and where can people get it? Um, we're, um, if all goes well, uh, we're going to be releasing the album uh, on uh, 25th of May. It's going to be available on all major avenues like iTunes, Spotify, mm -hmm. and all that. Um, people can download that. They can go to our Facebook page. It's facebook.com slash aboutnaksh. Um, they can go to our Twitter page. It's aboutnaksh again or Instagram. It's going to be available everywhere. At least they'll find a way to get to the album. Mm -hmm. So we would encourage them to have a listen to it. And then the, it's also going to be on our website. It's naksh.ca. Perfect. Wow. Well, thank you both so much for joining us today. Yeah. We wish you the best of luck on your journey.